Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited for today's video because today we are talking about all things the Nordstrom anniversary sale. So if you want to learn more about the sale and why you need to shop this sale, keep on watching. So every summer, typically in the middle of July to the beginning of August, Nordstrom puts on their biggest sale of the year. And if you shopped the sale before, you know what to expect. You know the excitement and the rush that you get when you shop the sale. But for those of you that haven't shopped it yet, this is your year. You really want to shop it. They have so many amazing, amazing items that go on sale. And I think the one thing that makes the Nordstrom anniversary sale so unique is that the items that are on sale are not summer items. They are the new fall and winter items. So instead of getting, you know, leftover clothes from summer, you're getting the new pieces, the new beauty items, new skincare sets. And not only do they do fashion items and beauty items, but there's also home items that go on sale, um, handbags, shoes, so many, so many great items from many different brands. And this year they are adding over a hundred new brands to the anniversary sale list, which is amazing. So let's talk about how you shop the sale. Now, last year, because of the pandemic, they did things a little bit differently. And I think they heard such great feedback that they're doing it again this year. So on July 6th, which is a big date, and we'll talk about that date um, in a little bit, but July 6th is the preview day. So that means everything that will be part of the Nordstrom anniversary sale will go live on their website. So that way you can look at the items and possibly the prices that they will be. Now there are different tiers in the way that you shop the sale. So if you are a Nordstrom cardholder member, you do have early access to the sale, meaning you can shop before the public. So ambassador cardholder members can shop as early as July 14th. Influencer cardholder members can shop on the 16th. And then the sale does open to the public on July 28th. The sale ends on August 8th. So basically the sale is live from July 12th until August 8th. So depending on your cardholder tier or if you are the public, um, you do have quite a window of time to shop the sale. Now, if you are not a cardholder member and you have to wait until the end of July, July 28th to shop the sale, you're probably thinking like, well, there's not going to be any good stuff left. All the cardholder members are going to get all the good stuff and we're going to get the leftovers. That is not the case by any means. One thing that they did really, really well, which I think is why they're doing it again this year, is let's say that you want a t-shirt, then it go, that's part of the sale. And let's say that Nordstrom has 400 of these t-shirts in stock. And on every access date, they will open up a few more pieces from inventory. So that way everybody has a chance to grab that item. So for example, maybe they release 100 on the 12th when Icon members can shop, and then another 100 on the 14th for ambassadors, another 100 on the 16th for influencers, and then 200 or 100 for um, the, re the remaining inventory for the public. So that way everybody has a chance to pick up the item that they want, and I think that is such a great way to do it so now let's talk about the july 6th date because that's preview day it's a really really important day so if you want to shop the sale my best recommendation for you would be to go on nordstrom's website download the app create an account it's free and what you're going to do is on preview day which is july 6th you are going to sh basically shop the sale. Now you can't actually purchase anything because it's preview day and you just have to wait until um, your access day to shop. But what I do every year is you're going to browse all of the Nordstrom anniversary items and just start adding things to your wish list. Everything that you're interested in, that you might want, that you have to have, 
that way you have a list of everything so that way when you are able to shop if you don't have a Nordstrom store near you you can just start adding everything that you want to your cart so that way you can purchase it now let's just say you add something to your wish list maybe that going back to that t-shirt example and you notice on the 14th that it goes out of stock and you can't shop the sale until August 28th. Don't delete that item from your cart because what happens is they will release more inventory on the next uh, tier access date. So just because something goes out of stock really quickly does not mean it will be out of stock by the time you can shop. So anything that goes out of stock, don't panic. Like I mentioned before, they do add more and more inventory as shop dates open up. So keep that in mind, but definitely start creating your wish list because there are certain things that go really quickly. So if you have your eye on something and you know it's a hot item, I would almost just buy that item right away and then go back and start adding things to your cart because once things are gone, they are gone. And by the time that they restock, they are not part of the anniversary sale. So I will be uploading a, another video on Wednesday and I am going to go over with you guys all of my top picks. I'm going to share with you guys what are some of the hottest items every single year? What's a good deal? What you could probably pass on? Um, I think if you look through the beauty stuff and the fashion stuff, you'll really start to see how good of a sale this is. Just one example, Barefoot Dreams cardigans. I buy them every single year at the sale. They retail for about $120. And every year at the sale, they drop to like 69 bucks. So there's such a good deal. And what I love about the sale is that it's not just super high-end luxury stuff. They really have items for every single person's budget. So if you are somebody that doesn't shop at Nordstrom because you think that everything is very expensive, it's definitely not the case. Take a look because I think you'll find some really, really good deals. Another hot tip I want to share with you guys is with the beauty items, there's a ton of beauty gift sets and it's not the junky stuff where it's like a perfume, a rollerball, and a lotion that kind of nobody buys. It's actual really nice things. And one of my tips for you guys is when you go through the preview sale, don't just look at stuff for you. I know I do, but don't just look at stuff for you. Think about the kids going back to school next month. Get them, you know, a bunch of clothes that are on sale. And the best tip I have for you is think about the holidays. I know it's only summer. I know nobody wants to think about the holidays right now. But this is the time of year that I actually buy most of the gift sets that I'm going to be gifting at the holidays because they're on such a good sale, such good deals. And by the time the holidays rolls around, it really takes the pressure off both mentally and financially of having to find stuff to buy people. If you already buy it now, then that's one less thing you have to buy around the holidays. And if I'm being honest, the gift sets that are sold at the Nordstrom anniversary sale are definitely best sellers, whether it be the brand, the um, scent, everything. It's literally so good. So if you are somebody that loves to give gifts, definitely check out the Nordstrom anniversary sale for the upcoming holiday season. I will leave all the key dates down in the description. For those that live in Canada, your shop dates are slightly later in the month than us in the US. So I will leave the um, Canadian dates down below as well. I will leave all the info and my recommendations and then stay tuned for Wednesday's video because I'm going to literally go through every single category, fashion, kids, beauty, home items and give you my top picks my recommendations and I'm gonna let you in on what items are hot every single year. So stay tuned for that video. If you're not subscribed, you definitely wanna hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Bye you guys.